Hey you guys, I'm Jared. Welcome to Jared's Coffee, Tea, and Gallery, where we feature lots of local artwork and artists and live music and shows, and not only delicious drinks, but so many more things. So I have so many different artists, and when I first opened this place, I really didn't know what I was going to do to get artists in here, because I wasn't sure how, but how I started was I actually put an ad on Craigslist looking for local artists who wanted to display in my store. It just took one ad and I just started getting all these artists. I had all these walls, I had no idea what I was going to do really. Um, and it just turned out to be something amazing and it's grown ever since. These big paintings here done by Alan Bogue is one of my all-time favorite artist. He's uh, someone I knew personally. Um, I used to watch him make these amazing pieces. Um, he did pass away a few years ago. Um, he had schizophrenia, and but he was just an amazing artistic person, as you can see in these amazing paintings. He could do something like this, and then he could also paint, you know, a beautiful lake or river, you know, completely opposite. But he was just very interesting and unique, and I love his pieces, and that's why I feature them right along this hallway as you walk into our store. So we carry a wide variety of jewelry. Um, growing up, my dad is a silversmith, so I've always been around jewelry. I used to actually travel coast to coast and sell jewelry, but now we started with our jewelry here, a wide variety of uh, sterling silver, uh, turquoise, gemstones, vintage jewelry, and of course our local artists make a lot of our local jewelry as well. So everything is handmade. There's over 40 different artists, and we're always changing the artwork out. It's always something new and different. I'm actually always changing the store around too. We just now expanded to our new side just a couple of weeks before COVID started and it took us many months to get this place together. We opened up the wall. There was lots of bricks here. We tore it down. Um, had this cool movie door made for it. We have shows on both sides, live music on this side, live music on that side. We also have group tables here for big large groups. Uh, of course it's private. Again, local artists, we like lots of artwork around. One of my artists actually made this beautiful tea with my logo on it. So these are actually tea leaves all around the main. There's my logo with a crown on it, and I actually got it tattooed, a naysayer tattoo a couple doors down. It does awesome work. When I opened here back in 2012, I just opened for jewelry and art. That's all I did was jewelry and art. I never had coffee. So we didn't bring the coffee until 2015. Someone I was working with actually asked me if I wanted to do coffee, so I really well, since I, I, I drank coffee, but not very often, and now I know all about coffee. So we brought that in, and it really just kind of brought a nice new vibe to the place. We remodeled it and um, did it ourselves, and just kind of blended the coffee with the drinks and the art, and it just kind of, you know, it just kind of flows and balances and shows and all that kind of create a nice, you know, atmosphere. So it just kind of came together, not planning from the very beginning, but just kind of happened, and it just worked out right, and we're very thankful for that. Welcome to our menu, and not only do we carry drinks, but we also carry gluten-free and vegan pastries as well. Uh, we also carry a variety of uh, uh, teas, herbal, caffeinated, iced or hot. Um, of course, we got uh, hot drinks as well, smoothies, uh, blended drinks, iced teas, uh, Italian sodas, lattes. Um, we also carry very popular nitro cold brew. We have a light and a dark nitro cold brew, and we also started carrying a CBD coffee. All right, so now we are getting some espresso shots, super yum. It's cacao with a slight hint of chocolate, super yummy. We're gonna actually gonna make a um, blended chai with some espresso in it. And we're gonna actually gonna pour these shots into the cream. Keep our shots from getting bitter, so we throw them in the cream right away. And there's our ice. We're gonna make a blended chai. So we use Maya chai, super yum. And we also use um, white Ghirardelli chocolate to give it a little bit of sweetness. And our shots in the cream go, it's actually an ice cream base that goes in there. And we put the lid on, we're gonna blend that right up. There we are. We're gonna scoop that right out. Yum, yum, yum. And voila. And put that lid on and it's dry and it's ready to go. Yes, absolutely. Actually, there's many stories because of this, just the artwork alone has so many stories behind it. But when you combine all these amazing pieces together, it just it, it kind of 
for me, it's kind of healing, it's soothing, it kind of gets your mind off of all the ruckus out there. So, you know, it's just kind of a getaway from, the, from all the craziness. Anyways, you guys, this is our fifth year, and we're very thankful for everybody because we just got no nominated for Mesa, number one coffee shop yesterday. Uh, second year in a row. So that's pretty awesome. So thank you everyone for supporting us. And if you haven't come yet, we're waiting for you. 